Bitcoin spot ETFs post $168 million in outflows, while Ethereum ETFs see meager inflows. Ruholamin Hakshana's last updated August 6, 2024 at 1031 GMT32 minutes read. Investors have withdrawn approximately $168 million from nine U.S. spot Bitcoin exchange traded funds ETFs on Monday. Over the last two days, net outflows from these ETFs have reached a staggering $405 million, according to data from Farside Investors. In contrast, spot Ethereum ETFs experienced net inflows totaling nearly $49 million during the same period. Grayscale's GBTC and Fidelity's FBTC led withdrawals. The most notable outflows were from Grayscale's Bitcoin ETF GBTC and Fidelity's Bitcoin fund FBTC with each fund witnessing withdrawals of about $69 million. Interestingly, Grayscale's Bitcoin mini trust BTC, a low cost alternative to GBTC, saw the highest daily inflows attracting almost $29 million. Bitwise's Bitcoin ETF BATB and Valkyrie's Bitcoin. Fundbur also recorded gains, each pulling in approximately $6 million. Other Bitcoin ETFs, such as BlackRock's iShares Bitcoin Trust, IBIT reported no flows. On the trading front, U.S. Bitcoin and Ethereum ETFs saw a combined trading volume of nearly $6 billion on Monday, with spot Bitcoin ETFs alone accounting for over $5 billion. IBIT and FBTC led this trading activity. Spot Ethereum. ETFs led by Grayscale's Ethereum ETF and BlackRock's iShares Ethereum Trust ETHA contributed around $715 million to the total volume. Eric Balchunas, an ETF analyst at Bloomberg, described the high trading volume during a market downturn as a reliable indicator of market fear. He emphasized that deep liquidity during such times is valuable to traders and institutions, suggesting long-term benefits for ETFs. BlackRock's ETH ETF sees inflows. Meanwhile, BlackRock's ETH recorded $47 million in net inflows on August 5, followed by Vanex and Fidelity's Ethereum ETFs, which collectively attracted nearly $33 million. Bitwise's Ethereum fund and Grayscale's Ethereum mini trusts also reported gains on the same day. However, the Grayscale Ethereum trust ETH faced significant outflows with nearly $47 million withdrawn, marking the lowest outflow since its conversion to an ETF. Over 10 trading days, the fund saw outflows exceeding $2.1 billion. Despite this, investors still hold approximately 234 million ETHA shares now valued at around $4.7 billion, according to Grayscale's latest updates. The recent crypto market crash, which began on August 4th, was triggered by jump trading substantial transfer of Ether to exchanges, leading to a sharp correction across the crypto markets. Bitcoin briefly dipped below $50,000 at the start of U.S. trading hours on August 5th, while Ethereum saw a more than 20% drop in its value within a day. As of the latest updates, Bitcoin has partially recovered to around $54,000 and Ethereum has rebounded by 6%, trading at over $2,400 as per CoinGecko's data. As reported, digital asset investment products saw outflows amounting to $528 million last week, marking the first downturn in four weeks. The exodus is believed to be a response to mounting concerns over a potential recession in the United States compounded by geopolitical uncertainties and consequent widespread liquidations across various asset classes. For one, the Bank of Japan's BOJ decision to raise interest rates for the first time in 17 years due to concerns over the yen's purchasing power decline against the U.S. dollar has triggered apprehension within risk on asset markets, prompting widespread sell-offs. Follow us on Google News.